find the resultant vector and their magnitudes. If we take one example, if v vector, v1 vector is equal to 3i plus 4j plus k vector, that component is along the x-axis, along y-axis and along z-axis, r, j, k. And v2 vector is i vector minus j vector minus k vector. i, j, k are the unit vectors along x, y, z axis respectively. Therefore, v1 vector, solve that example, v1 vector is equal to 3i plus 4j plus k vector and v2 vector is equal to i vector minus j vector minus k vector. To calculate there the magnitude of v1 plus v2. How to calculate that magnitude? Magnitude therefore First, we calculate the addition of that two vectors, v1 vector plus v2 vector. Therefore, v vector, v1 vector plus v2 vector is equal to. Summation of i, I component, summation of jj component and summation of kk component means 3i vector plus 4j vector plus k vector plus i vector minus j vector minus k vector. i i component is correct. 3i vector plus i vector plus 4j vector minus j vector plus k vector minus k vector. Therefore, that component is 3 plus where component 1 multiplied by i vector means 3 plus 1 into i vector plus 4i minus j means 4 minus 1 into j vector plus 1 minus 1 into k vector. Therefore, 4i vector, 4 minus 1 is 3j vector, 1 minus 1 is 0k vector means 4i vector k, k component is 0 therefore 4i plus 3j vector this is the addition of that two vectors v1 vector plus v2 vector then calculate its magnitude magnitude of v1 plus v2 therefore magnitude of v1 vector plus v2 vector is equal to v1 plus v2 is equal to square root of component of that square. Square of the that component means 4 square plus 3 square. 4 square is 16 plus 3 square is 9. Taking square root on both. Square root of 25. Summation of that both. 16 plus 9 is 25 is equal to Therefore, V1 plus V2, their magnitude is therefore V1 plus V2 is equal to I. V1 plus V2 is equal to I. Then calculate the magnitude and direction. To find out also magnitude and direction of the two vectors, direction is find out alpha is equal to tan inverse Q sin theta upon P plus Q cos. They calculate their direction. Take another example to find out the magnitude and direction of the resultant of two vectors. If V1 vector is equal to 2i minus 3j vector and V2 vector is equal to minus 6i plus 5j vector, determine the magnitude and direction of V1 plus V2. How to calculate their values of the resultant vector, its magnitude and direction? V1 vector is equal to 